Being a Secret City Wild Bot is, uh, it's more than just building a robot in six weeks. We're here building friendships with one another and we're inspiring each other every day to go and reach for our dreams and make those dreams a reality. We're inspiring our culture by inspiring each other. And then we try to inspire our student body in our new STEM First Robotics class, where we show the kids um, the link in between idea and then forming that into a reality. We've made First Loud by demoing our robots at our talent shows and even our pep rallies and you know, seeing everybody's response and seeing everybody interact with our robot. Um, it's truly inspiring. Furthermore, through our demos, like the United Way fundraiser, we make First Loud and inspire the companies and the businesses in our community to go out and help first. I think that the most rewarding thing about being a Secret City Wildbot is getting out into the community and demoing our robot to all these kids. Um, it's one of our goals as a team to inspire them to pursue STEM careers when they're older. So to that end, we hosted a Sumobot summer camp at our local children's museum for two years. And that camp alone actually led to the formation of two other FLL teams in our area. The coolest part is those two teams went on to host an invitational that they later asked us to volunteer at. Even during the holiday season, we make First Loud. Like, we went to the Oak Ridge Christmas Parade in December, and it was really inspiring to see all the kids' faces light up when we drove our robot around. We've really done everything, like radio interviews, to demos at events in Knoxville, to even demos at summer reading programs in Norris, just to make First Loud to everyone. We've hosted the past meet and greets to inspire the teams in our region to embrace gracious professionalism and cooperation, and also to build the hype around the upcoming season. And in combination with the meet and greet, we've hosted since the year after our inception what we like to call the quick build, where we invite the surrounding teams in our region to bring their rookies to learn how to build a kitbot chassis. And then seeing this event grow from nine to 16 teams has been a great way to see our region grow. So in addition to the past workshops that we had at our Quick Build, like the Lab View and the Strategy Workshops, this year we actually integrated a Business and Media and an AV and Live Streaming Workshop to really give rookie and veteran teams alike the tools that they needed to sustain themselves. So being a Secret City Wildbot, it's more than just the robots. We're here changing lives and we're here to transform our culture.